Xanthelasma vs. Syringoma Xanthelasma palpebrarum is a blemish caused by cholesterol deposits on the skin surface and usually occurs in clusters around the eyes. It is very small to over 1 cm in diameter and is usually found under the eyelids. Syringoma on the other hand, is a flesh-colored increase in blood vessels in the eye that is often located at the base of the eyelid, usually in a cluster around the eyes, but also on the nose, nose bleeds, ears or even under the eye sockets. It has a diameter of about 1 to 3 mm and looks like a round bump on the skin surface, which is colored yellow. Syringomas can itch if you sweat or if you're otherwise asymptomatic, i.e. they do not bother you or show any other symptoms. Xanthelasma palpebrarum is a small flesh-colored, skin-colored lump in the eye that is usually yellowish and can cause itching or swelling. Because of the way syringoma sometimes looks and feels, it can easily be mistaken for xanthelasma, but it is not actually composed of the same organic elements. Syringoma vs. Xanthelasma Syringomas often occur as flesh, colored single or multiple skin papules that are located commonly in women around the eyelids during puberty. They are rooted in the deepest layers of the skin and tend to occur especially more in women than men. According to Friedman and Butler's classification scheme, four main variants of the syringome have been recognized, localized forms, forms associated with trisomy 21, generalized forms, including several eruptive syringomas, and a generalized form. The mileage, often referred to as a milk stain, is a cyst filled with keratin that can occur directly under the epidermis. Clinically eruptive syringes can be confused with the nulled granulomas on the trunk, therefore histopathological examination is indispensable. It occurs in combination with oily skin or acne and can be red or inflamed or both, and it is a non-pigmenting bump on the skin. Syringomas are benign, non-cancerous growths caused by an overactive sweat gland and are usually defined as benign growth on the face. Syringoma is a type of benign tumor, but it is not carcinogenic and can cause pain, itching, irritation and irritation. Syringomas can grow and develop in a variety of ways, for example under the skin, in the face, in the eyes or in other parts of the body. Xanthelasma or milia Milia, or milk spots, can be seen in newborns, teenagers and adults and they look very much like baby acne or white heads. There are different environments, like those that spontaneously break out of the sweat glands when you sweat. Milia occur when the skin has been damaged and this is called traumatic milia. You can have milia removed, but this procedure should be done by a dermatologist and it can cause a lot of pain and discomfort. Xanthelasma and other skin conditions Xanthelasma is characterized by a yellowish coating on the outer edges of the eyelids, under the eyes and in the upper part of the face. If your eyelid looks more like a yellowish, extended coating, you may experience xanthelasma. The lesions are symmetrical and can be located on the outer edges of the eyelids, under the eyes and in the upper part of the face. Several methods have been used to treat XP, including antibiotics, anti-inflammatory drugs and topical corticosteroids, but not too much effect due to their nature. They can be treated with xanthal register, one of the best approaches to a professional way to remove them gently and having the benefit that they can be removed in the comfort of your own home. Find the solution to removing xanthalasma and eyelid xanthomas at xanthalasmatreatment.com or xanthal.com.